Hello and welcome. So this is a quick information video on the clan avatar, which can't be gotten until next week since that's how long a clan citadel cycle takes. And clan avatars, they can give various different buffs depending on the tier of your citadel. You can have up to three buffs stored in one avatar, but only one avatar can be summoned at a time, and only one buff may be active at a time. For PVM, you have Heal Over Time and Protector. Heal Over Time heals HP over time, and Protector absorbs some of the damage you would have taken and takes it away from the avatar. For Skillers, you have a XP boost, 3% if you're in the same world as your clan avatar, and 6% if you're within range of the avatar. For Warring Clans, you have a random resurrection where if a clan mate dies, it has a random chance, well it has a chance to revive the player. Only one buff may be active at a time, so the other buffs will probably not be used. And the bad thing about an update like this is, if the update is too good, people will complain about having to be in a citadel, like be in a clan. And if it's not good at all, it just becomes dead content. Also, there has been an update to the Scam of Fortune. Now you have an option to turn your reward into cash, so you're not stuck with useless items that's kind of a hassle to sell in the Grand Exchange. Oh, and another update is instead of offering 200 mil in the Scam of Fortune, it has been boosted up to 400 mil for this week. And geez, I wonder if they're trying to make up for the billions that were duped in the max cash glitch. And they didn't even ban everybody. Like, there's quite a few number of people. You can still search their name on the high score and find them. So that's all for this video. Thank you very much for watching and have a nice day.